Hi guys, I hope you are doing great and even if it's not the best time for you, I'm sending you much love and sun from me. Today I'm coming with a chill video, so grab a tea and enjoy Bali vibes. I'm taking you guys today with me on a little beauty tour to show you everything what I do to feel a bit better in my body. Well, let's face it, we all have bad body image days, so don't worry, I also face the same shit sometimes. However, I found some solutions, which makes me feel more appreciative of myself. First up, pedicure. My mom used to say that a nice pop of color on your feet will brighten your day straight away. So this is what we are gonna do. I like to visit local place like this one. The pedicure costs around $7 with a massage and scrub. Girls are super kind and professional. And additionally, I can practice my language skills because I started learning Bahasa Indonesia. Next stop, massage. I used to hate them, but since I moved to Asia, I fell in love with being more flexible in my body. And this is exactly what massage does for me. Open my shoulders and remove around 30% of sciatic pain. The rest of it, I unfortunately got a trip with yin yoga. Tuesday was a day date with my boyfriend. Sometimes I feel like dinner and nighttime date are a little bit overrated. So I like to mix it up and do some activities together, but during the day. He had to go for a roots refresher because he dyes his hair and I joined him for a little trim of my split ends. So we had kind of a hairdresser appointment date. <laughs> And oh wow, my hair looked gorgeous. I instantly felt better. I paid around 300k rupiah, which is around $20 for trim, wash and head massage. Good food makes my tummy happy and we all know that our guts take a significant part of regulating our mood. So on the way back, we grabbed lunch in our favorite salad bar on the island. They have a variety of fresh veggies, so you can create your own bowl. I like my classic go-to order, which is pretty big, but well, take some notes, you might thank me later. For the base, I'm using quinoa and romaine lettuce, and for my toppings, I go for pumpkin, mushrooms, avocado, edamame, egg, broccoli, tempeh, roasted chickpeas, cherry tomatoes, and flax seeds with avocado dressing. They also have meat and cheese, however, I like my hearty vegetarian option. So yeah, treat yourself for better, stronger body, mind and happier soul. our health we swing by a desert food stand and my boyfriend picked for us three cream puffs chocolate vanilla and matcha to be honest we were not really impressed by the taste so we decided to pass on them however i want to give them a second chance and come back for my beloved cupcakes back in europe i used to have my favorite spot in poland in krakow but here in bali i feel like cupcakes are not really a thing so when i saw those i decided to come back later and yeah wednesday some days are dedicated for myself only time 
but others I like to connect with people. I went to a French cafe to work on my projects and social media. Additionally, cappuccino on almond milk and French playlist upgraded my mood within a second. And the work flows smoother and nicer when you gave yourself some good and positive vibes from the outside world. Wednesday was also a very special day for me because our best friend was going for a two-month trip away from Bali and our other best friend were coming back from South America. So we had a welcoming and a farewell party. I had so much fun with guys and totally relaxed and chill time. And this is how I usually treat myself whenever I have a down mood caused by some negative thoughts on myself. Hope you enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more to come. Have an awesome weekend guys, sending you much love from Bali.